Okay, so I got the Nagan revolver. Um, gonna shoot two misses and then hopefully I'll try and hit something. Oh, nice. <laughs> to talk just a little bit about that revolver that I have. Uh, the, it's the Nagant revolver, the M1895. I picked up my Nagant revolver at a pawn shop about, I don't know, four or five years ago. I, I had been looking and looking and looking, couldn't find it, and finally I, I was able to get one. And uh, it was in really good condition, came with the holster and, and whatnot. What I really wanted to do with that Nagant revolver, of course, is uh, I, I bought it with the intention of someday threading the barrel and suppressing it. And I looked at what needed to be done, and in order to get that to work, uh, the barrel had to be pulled, uh, threaded, and the front sight had to be recontoured slightly uh, so that you could screw on the suppressor and have it fit properly. So I found a local gunsmith who was willing to thread the barrel and recontour the, the front sight. Now, a unique characteristic of that uh, little Nagant 1895 uh, revolver is that it, unlike all other revolvers, or most all that I know of, it, uh, so most revolvers have a, a little gap between the cylinder and the barrel. It's the barrel cylinder gap. And uh, hot gases will usually, when you fire around it, uh, as the bullet um, enters into the barrel, the gases come out that that gap, and so you can't really suppress uh, efficiently and effectively other revolvers uh, that have that barrel cylinder gap. But the unique thing about this Nagant revolver is that it has the gas seal design. So as you cock the hammer or as if you're using it in double action and you pull the trigger, then what it does is it actually moves the cylinder forward and the ammo, it, the ammo is actually unique too. It, uh, the bullet sits inside the, the brass case so uh, it does not stick out at all from the top of the brass. And so what happens is the cylinder moves forward and the brass uh, comes forward and it creates a gas seal with that brass inside that chamber and so uh, effectively you do not have the hot gases that escape uh, in a traditional revolver with that barrel cylinder gap. <laughs> That's quiet. Okay. And uh, the way you remove these is you, you can't pop the cylinder out, so you gotta, you can either do it with your finger pop them out and grab them out that way or you can unscrew this slide this rotate it and pop them out so anyways little Nagant revolver suppressed mm -hmm.